Hello guys, welcome back to another video. This is Speed Network. It's been a while I haven't recorded a video on YouTube and one of my uh, videos got removed as well due to hacking contents. So I had uh, a thought about it and uh, you know one of the videos got most likes and most views up to um, 3,000 views I guess which is a tool called Mosint and a lot of you requested um, from me to have like a, a tutorial on how to download it and how to install it on your machine so without further ado let's get into it so I have it saved, I think, in my um, op directory um, on under scripts. Yeah, so if you see the two mosint right here, and um, alas, you can see that the tool is installed. But this tool is built on Go, so you need to have Golang to uh, install it. So um, you go to golang.org and then um, you download and then we give you a, like um, a selection of you know according to your OS which one you want. So you have to select um, the Linux star right here. Either or is fine. And then uh, you install it, uh, unzip the tar file, and uh, copy the the path into your bash rc file, and then you execute that. So um, the repo, actually, if you have, you go and search. Let me go to DuckDuckGo, um, and then look for a uh, mosint if you type in mosint github and then uh, the first is and the this creator alpskin so um, as you can see is has a 2.5 thousand stars and is built in on go as you can see here on the tag and this tool actually is useful for email validation, checking social accounts, check data breaches and password leaks. Uh, you can find emails, domains, you know, uh, DNS lookup. And um, if you want to take it um, further up, the, you can use this one of these services, Hunter.io, Email Wrap. You know, those are all databases that require your own API key. So before you set this one, you need to have your API key set up. And they show you here if you want to use the full feature using your API keys. You can either install the tool by um, following the go install right here. Copy this and put it in your terminal. Uh, what I did is I copied the whole repo. So I went to code and copy this and that and did uh, git clone in um, the op directory uh, scripts and then I launched it so to use the tool is pretty much simple um, you have to go use go main dot go which is um, the executable file and uh, I skipped run go run main if I can type main um, dot go and um, I'm gonna do my email so that um, YouTube doesn't come after me so go run main dot go and then hit enter and that's the tool launched and as you can see it's really really quick so it shows that you know my email is verified it's not disposable like those um, email that you find online yeah um, and uh, social media is not related to Spotify Twitter Adobe Discord and Instagram and here you can see all the IP address 
and the Google servers, the DNS, the SMTP. And uh, if I have, if I want to set up the APIs, then I can uh, look deeper and deeper. So this tool actually is really, really useful if you are into, you know, uh, OSINT um, tool. It can help you look up emails, help you do a lot of uh, open source intelligence. Um, so yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. This is the, the tool. Uh, let me know in the comments if you want uh, me to uh, go further in details for this tool. If you have any other tools that you want me to cover up uh in the video or the next video i will try my best to uh, upload videos weekly but um yeah L let me know in the comments and um just want to share with you guys that i will be dropping also um hack the box uh walkthroughs and tutorial as well so i'm um, working on the blog and i'm working on um a notion uh, best practice uh, about hacking tools, shell scripts, and so on and so forth that I'm gonna uh, drop really, really soon. So I uh, appreciate you guys and uh, thank you for sticking up to the end. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and all that good jazz. And peace out.